Hey friends, this is the Missable from our Half Acre Homestead. And you've been asking for food that really schmacks. Well, I'm gonna do a food that really schmacks, but it's not really from the book. But it's along those lines. What I have here is a homemade corned beef. It's made with venison. I got me some sauerkraut and an onion. Let's start with that, shall we? Okay, now it's oh, late at night, so I'm just going to take my corned beef, because it's frozen, and I'm going to put it in the crock pot on low, and I'm just going to empty this sauerkraut all over top. Set Papa's onion right on top there, and we're just going to put that on low and let it percolate all night. Tomorrow I'll add some potatoes. Okay just before I go to bed I think I'm gonna throw in a couple of peppercorns and a bay leaf. Just because I really didn't season the sauerkraut a lot and neither did I heavily season the corned beef. All right this has been cooking since last night and all day. I've taken the bay leaf out. It looks horrible. <laughs> it looks awful. But uh, we'll see what Papa has to say about it. Yeah, scrape the fat off the top of that. But look at how nice and red that meat is, eh? Mm. That's our venison corned beef. Yeah, that's our venison corned beef. Let's have a nice, oh yeah. Now I cooked it in sauerkraut because uh, this corned beef isn't as seasoned as store-bought so the sa I counted on the sauerkraut giving it a little bit more flavor. Mm. Oh. oh yeah, I gotta have, this is very I Irish meets Canadian, eh? Meets German, I guess. Well, oh, that's right though. Hot though, Ooh. eh? Ooh. Thanks, honey. Yeah, I was so excited I forgot to film the ending for that. Um, but what I also want to add was be the corned beef was homemade corned beef from venison. The sauerkraut was homemade and home canned. And the potatoes came out of the garden. The onions, the only thing that really kind of came from the store. So if you're using store-bought corned beef or even if you're using homemade corned beef you may want to add a pint to a pint and a half of water to the entire crock pot or it might become a little too salty ours was a little salty for howie but just right for me and i have another i have another recipe coming up somebody shared a recipe with me on sauerkraut and ribs so that's going to be coming up real soon this is the miss and wolfie from our half acre homestead saying food that really schmacks may not have come from the book but it schmacked just the same take care god bless